Hello, my students. How are you today? May you always be healthy, fine, and be blessed at home, yeah? Alright, in this session, we're going to talk about our topic that we have discussed a few weeks ago. Do you still remember? At the beginning, in Unit A, we talked about... Yeah! Home activities or daily activities or the things that we do at home. Alright, do you remember and mention what home activities that you usually do regularly at home? Now mention why? And then? And then? And then, and many more, yeah? There is a lot of things that we can do at home. Like, you can help your mom cooking in the kitchen, study, homework, do chores, and then sweep the floor, wash the dishes, and many more. Okay, last week I give you 10 questions about simple present tense. Do you still remember the function of simple present tense? Here, simple present tense is not simple yeah, sometimes, but it say it's simple. Okay, when you want to talk about your daily habits, home activities, or things that you do every day or activities or things that you do regularly you can use simple present tense yeah, that's the function to tell events or activities that we do every day or regularly or it is also used to talk about general facts. For example, the sun. The sun rises in the east. Is it the fact that the sun rises in the east? Yes, that's the fact. Okay, now we are going to discuss the 10 questions that you have done at home. And I'd like to thank everyone for those who have submitted their homework to Thank you, good job. But unfortunately, I still find some of you who didn't do it properly. So there were still inappropriate answers in your questions. So let's discuss now. Number one. Okay. I like lemonade very much. Remember, you have to look at first the subject. So here, you just need to add S or ES, or you don't need to add S or ES to the words. These are the words, yeah? Like, like, listen, where, teach, do, read, go, rain, wash, hurry. Those are words. Yeah. Alright, now let's see number one. I is it I like or I likes? Now we gotta see the subjects. If the subjects are they, we, I, you, yeah, remember if the subjects are now look at this. Subjects. They, we, I, you. You do not add S to S to the verbs, yeah? No S or ES. So for example, she, sorry. They, work, I, work. Remember, yeah, so here, you got to write, I like. 
Number two, the girl. Now, because it's only one person, the girl, you can change the girl into she. Now remember, if the subjects are he, she, or it, you have to add the verb as or as. She works. He works. It works. Look at this. The girl always. She. Listen or listen. Yes, it's listen. Word three. Janet, male word. Now it's a girl's name. Yeah, the same. Like a girl. So you can change this to she. Janet, male word. Wears. Number four, Mr. Smith. Mr. Smith is a man, so you can change it into he. Yeah, Mr. Smith teach or teaches. Remember, if the subjects are he, she, or it, you have to add verb s or es. Yeah, you have to add s or es to the verb. If the subjects are he, she, or it. Now number four, Mr. Smith teaches. Now it's correct, okay? Good. Number five, you blank do your homework after school. If the subjects are they, we, I, you, you don't add S or S to the word. So, no S or ES. Yeah. So it's stay the same and yeah, you do your homework. Number six is sometimes this one. Read. Number seven, Emily. You can change it to she. Emily, he she it with S for the answer. So Emily goes. Number eight. It often rain, rains, yeah, rain. Sorry, rains. Yeah. Number nineteen and his ear. Now, now this number is kind of different because it's more than one person. If you see, there are two here, like two characters or two persons. You can change it into they, actually. So they, we, it belongs to this type. Yeah, they, I, you. You don't have to add S or S. So, he and his sister watch. The last number, the 10, I always, it belongs to this type. I always hurry. Okay, that's all 10 numbers, yeah? You understand? I hope so, okay? If you still don't understand, you can just let me know, yeah? I'll explain once again, yeah? Okay, guys, thank you very much. That's all for our discussion, yeah?